Hey guys, welcome to another how to play Dune online tutorial. And if last time we covered the Hamaki part, this time we're gonna see some other methods of playing Dune 2000 online. And these ones are not that popular, and actually people uh, don't really use this, but why not to um, actually cover them? Let's go to full screen. This shit is giving me some trouble about resolution here. Should be fine now. Okay, let's let's try bigger resolution. Hopefully, it's not it's not gonna kick us out. Okay, good. Uh, so let's uh, let's see how else you can play online. So one would be Hamaki, which is right here. See, we have a test I uh, test the channel here. You can open chat window, spam some crap here. But what if you are just not managing to get this working and you really want to play your brother or something? Then you can try Tungle. And Tungle is also a very good uh, alternative here. I'm pretty sure um, it's good, even though people don't really use it. So just go ahead. And Google for Tungle. So, I'm gonna download obviously the software. It's gonna download you an installer. Well, nice, nice um, pop ups here or something. You obviously gotta love Naruto. It's opening us in our blank page here. Which was probably also... What is this shit? Oh yeah, I, I don't know where I got this uh, Windows XP CD, but it installed me some download manager or something. I don't know what this is. When I had XP on my machine, I didn't have this, so let's start download and just open it. Well, we don't really want, so let's just forget about that. So it's installing like just like any other program would do. And for this uh, method, like using Tungle, you can certainly use the Dune that I, the version of Dune that I covered in the Hamaki tutorial. But I'm pretty sure if there are any people playing on Tungle, they won't uh, have that version, or there are there are low chances for them to have it because pretty much um, the people who actually do modding for Dune or they make m maps for multiplayer and do stuff like I am doing, they are all on Hamaki, not on Tangle. So yeah, just simple installation because we, d we don't care about anything else for the moment. I don't know, maybe you should go with the custom one and you know, disable any toolbars or something, but I don't, I don't think Tangle is installing any other crapware, you know what I'm saying. So we're waiting it to be finished which should happen very soon also note that uh, both Hamaki and Tungle oh we actually need to restart a virtual virtual machine so let's go ahead and do that um, you gotta note that both Tungle and Hamaki are installing some uh, um, uh, additional network drivers so uh, yeah, don't be surprised when you see those in your network connections. But that's not really a problem. Some people reported that they did have some problems with the Hamaki adapter not letting them to connect to the internet, but that's probably that's probably very rare. I've obviously didn't hear that more than twice. And that was some years ago, so maybe Hamaki fixed that, whatever it was. Okay, 
So waiting here to boot up into the awesome virtual PC here that we have, which is very slow at the moment. Also, I'm not sure if you are seeing this uh, cursor flickering here. Probably you don't, but it's very funny. We got a welcome screen and a very screwed up resolution, basically. Yep, I can see that very well. Thank you, Windows, for letting me know. So let's let's fix this because it looks horrible at the moment. Okay. Oh, this should be fine. That's what we were using. But it's not gonna let us do it now, I guess. It's just retarded. Come on. Don't be an idiot. Alright, this is weird. Let me see what's wrong here. I should resize this window, I think. <clears throat> Alright, let's try now. Oh, come on. This is really bad. Great bullshit. Now it won't work at all. So I guess we're screwed with it now. Just as it is. I'm not gonna waste any more time trying to fix that. Because apparently it's not wor wanting to work. Uh, let's try once more. Okay, whatever. So, it's not gonna let us go to full screen back, so let's just do it normal way in a window. Which looks pretty crappy, but that's it. Just if we can get to the start button here. Can we? Okay, good. So, open up your Tango Beta program. And please note that this, that for this program, oh crap, we don't have Flash Player. Well, let's do it because we are doing a tutorial here, right? Oh, what? Yeah, sure, why not? Let's do it. So, uh, yeah, apparently it does need Flash Flash Player, so. Watch out not to download some fake Flash Player executable because those are bundled with malware lately. Wait, what? What's wrong here? Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's download. No, open. Alright, so it's installing a flash player. Apparently, you need this to run Tango. That's pretty bad because uh, it's needed to display those videos. When you are starting Tango, there are a few videos like tutorials about how to use Tango and shit. So that's why you need them. And meanwhile, let's go ahead and check those two adapters I was talking about. <clears throat> they are in the oops network connections, and here they are, Hamaki and Tango. Now this network cable unplugged means nothing, obviously, because there's no cable for it, and it's gonna get uh, fixed when you are opening Tango. We're still waiting here for the flash player to install. Meanwhile, let's play with the resolution again because I really want to make it full screen ag again. Really hope we can. This just won't let me do it. Freaking bastards. Still not working for some reason. Um What should I do? 
I don't know if this would change anything. I I, I honestly don't know why it's not working because it's pretty it's pretty retarded. All right, let's try try until it works, which would probably never happen. Let's play some solitaire. Why not? Because we all love solitaire now, right? All right, guys. Sorry for the delay, but you know, I actually never really, I wasn't really good at this game. I really suck at it, basically. Yeah, whatever. Should start practicing. What's wrong? Okay, it was frozen. So while I am showing my solitaire skills here, the flash player is almost ready. Um, it installs Google Chrome apparently. Well, that's shit. I didn't ask you to do that, flash player. So you're starting to become shit as well. Anyway, Google Chrome is a very good browser, so it's doing you a favor, actually. Um. I guess I need some help here. Not about, we don't care about that. So yeah guys, sorry for the delay, I honestly, oh my god, do you see this? It was like the start, the taskbar was like div divided or something. So sorry for the delay, I I uh, didn't know that you actually need flash player to run this because you know everybody has flash player so basically it doesn't really ask you to download it but since this was a fresh fresh new uh, Windows XP I didn't install anything else than Dune, Hamaki and Tangle so it didn't have flash player go away you internet explorer go ahead Solitaire I'm really too noob for that game and hopefully you can see the freaking taskbar here so let's start tangle now hopefully he's not gonna ask us for any of our crap let's close this shit because it's eating our precious resources honestly no, we don't really need it. Apparently, we can uh, deny that. I didn't see it. But obviously, you're gonna need Flash Player in your life, so trust me. Now, it will ask you. It will ask you for a username and password, which you are. If this is the first time you're using it, you're obviously not gonna have one. So go ahead and where is that register button? Well, I can see it apparently. Oh yeah, click here to register. So yeah, it's gonna probably open up a browser and redirect you to the reg registration page on their uh, server. So, but we, we, I do have an account. Hopefully, I remember my password and username because it was some time ago. Connecting to Tango. Let's see if I was right. Um. Apparently, no. Yeah, so uh, I don't remember them very well. Connecting to Tango. Yeah, so I'm failing it very badly now. But. Connecting to Tango. Apparently. Uh, that's all you need to do. Just, you know, get a good login here. 
which is pretty shit. And yeah, what can we do now? Because we can do shit without an account. I can't remember my password or my username because I'm not sure if this is the one I was using. So yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Let's let's see. Give me a second. I'm gonna pause this. All right. So apparently, I kind of have it on my host PC. So this was a big epic fail. But anyway, I was wanting to show you how to install it as well. So I guess the virtual PC did help. So we are now logged in. I still don't remember my password, but I had everything, uh, you know, autofill. So now go to the network search right here to join the net the Dune 2K network. Please note that this uh that Tango has a very big ass network for free coming from them. So you don't have to pay for playing here. And go ahead go right here and click this arrow thing here and type in Dune 2000. it will search for the network and here it is as I told you there's nobody online at the moment but you may find someone at some point but as I told you everyone is using uh, Hamaki so that's gonna be about it to play from here you are going to do the exact, the exact same thing like you would do with Hamaki but instead of selecting the IP starting with 25 you're gonna have to select the one starting with 7 right here you can see it virtual IP so that's pretty much the only difference so yeah thanks for watching sorry for all the delays and fails and our kind of random shit and sorry for my retarded solitaire skills and I really hope this helped you and we're gonna see you later with more tutorials so Okay, bye.